When two jumping spiders go head to head, it's a case of look before you leap. The steamy jungles of Central America are home to more than 5,000 species of jumping spider, each one more striking than the last. The yellow jumping spider might not be quite as colorful as some of her cousins, but she makes up for it with street smarts. They've got relatively simple brains, but they're clearly using these brains in really complicated ways to remember where things are and make quite complicated decisions about how to attack their prey. The huge comic book eyes are constantly peeled for prey they can see 40 body lengths away. And don't think for a second that you can sneak past unnoticed. She really does have eyes in the back of her head. A total of eight orbs ring the head, providing a wide-angled world view. The smaller eyes focus on movement, so they detect something moving in front of them. It's the big anterior median eyes that provide the crucial information for where and when to attack. Those extraordinary orbs sense color, contrast, even ultraviolet light. Just what you need when pinpointing prey and launching long-range attacks. Death comes swiftly. Fast-acting venom paralyzes the victim almost instantly. But what happens when she encounters an enemy who possesses the same skills? The tiger jumping spider has also earned her stripes as a pouncing predator. She's a polyphagous predator, which means she'll kill and eat pretty much any creature that she can. But some jumping spiders actually prefer spiders over insects, including spiders just like themselves. Squat and compact, the tiger has the perfect build for long distance leaping, jumping up to 20 body lengths in a single bound on hydraulic legs. Now that's deadly accuracy, a direct hit. You could almost hear her making the calculations for the trajectory of that jump. And she took her time to make sure she got it right. Brava. But the kill might not be quite so easy when the tiger jumping spider runs into her yellow counterpart. You might as well just flip a coin or pick the spider you like the look of most. It's that close a call. They're similar in size and possess identical powers. Which one will get the jump on the other? Two lethal leapers face off. Then, a multi-clawed killer goes on the attack. And later, mortal combat in the treetops. forest leaf, two jungle gymnasts are about to meet in mortal combat. A yellow jumping spider is prowling for prey. Nearby, a tiger jumping spider will happily make a meal of her close relation.
both have incredible eyesight, extraordinary jumping ability, and potent venom. Which one is the faster draw? The combatants eyeball each other. If spiders could break out in a nervous sweat, they would both be doing it about now. Because they can both see and recognize the danger that they're both facing. The yellow jumping spider holds her ground. The tiger blinks first, backing off. But changes her mind. They attack and counterattack. It's a standoff. The tiger makes a strategic withdrawal. The yellow jumping spider is on full alert. But the tiger has a new vantage point. It's all about establishing the best angle of attack and getting in an accurate shot first. Like its feline namesake, the tiger pounces. Injecting lethal venom. For these spiders, the old saying, look before you leap, really sums it all up. In this particular case, the tiger jumping spider had the best view and the best trajectory, and that proved to be the decisive advantage. Like any tiger in the wild, feeding isn't about dining etiquette. She vomits digestive enzymes into her victim and slurps up the liquidized flesh. Leaving the yellow jumping spider very deflated. So much for the sisterhood.